morning so it is a new dawn a new day a new life um <laughs> it is sunday and today is the day of the christmas pug meet and i haven't been to a pug meet for a few months just because like the weather's not been great but today is a nice crisp sunny morning and i'm looking forward to seeing some pugs in their christmas gear and rupert loves it he loves frolicking with his own kind but also i found out that the bulldog meet up is also today at Christchurch so there's gonna be a lot of squishy dogs a lot of squishy flat faced dogs but it's so funny because I love when other breeds like from a distance like see all these little dogs for some reason all dogs are obsessed with pugs like I've just found this I've, I've found this out but anyway I'm looking forward to it so we are at the park it's such a pretty day like it's a really nice wintry morning the chimes are there he is <laughs> the chimes are chiming Lovely. I've seen some bulldogs already. <laughs> Come on, oh, baby. Sorry, I'm surprised. Hey. Oh, it's such a nice morning, isn't it? Yes. Come on in. We've seen all your puggy friends. Squidgy. <laughs> Squidgy. It's okay. It's okay. His little sand jump is a bit mucky. It's okay. We got watched. Come on. Yes. You're so small. Hello. They're great, aren't they? <laughs> but no, we've been, we've, we're over there for about 20 minutes. Yeah, it, it, I mean, what time is it? It's 11 now. Oh, it is 11. Yeah. yeah. Hi! Hi! Hello! Hello! Oh, Hello! Little <laughs> 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 Why do they all think you've got treats? He's just sitting there. Oh, someone you <laughs> That's so cute. Hi, are you excited? Ruba's like, so excited <laughs> Hello, 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 hello. Hi. <laughs> Marilyn. 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 We were just saying we love Marilyn. <laughs> oh yeah, more have turned up, which is nice. Look at them. Hello, babies. See it happen eventually. There we go. We're a bit better now. Hello. <laughs> This penguin is just loving life. You know? <laughs> we saw it walking. We were like, yes. It's Marilyn! <laughs> I know. But chunky. They're like, <laughs> oh. <laughs> Oh. Hi babies! <laughs> wow. I love when they wipe their feet! <laughs> oh. Oh. Hello! Hello babies! <laughs> you got an itch? <laughs> <laughs> we love Marilyn. Yeah, <laughs> 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 boy now. <laughs> 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 Yes. Oh, all tired yeah. out. We're parked, so it's okay. We wouldn't normally sit there when we drive, but look at him. Rupert! He's tired. He's been running around with his puggy friends. But he loves resting on the steering wheel, doesn't he, Dad? He does. That's all he ever does. We should get him one just to sleep on. <laughs> he puts his chin on it. <laughs> So we put the wreath up. This is the wreath that I made the other day at the little workshop. We've popped it on uh, my parents' door just because it would be wasted on mine. It wouldn't look right on mine. So um, yeah, I really love it. Do you like it? Yeah. <laughs> I'm really pleased with that. But we literally started with like a ring of moss. And then once Christmas is over, if I just take the baubles off and the bow, we can put it in the garden and then like birds can come and nest. 
Anyways, I'll shut the door because it's freezing and so windy. I'm at my parents' house now in my old childhood bedroom. Well, it's not my childhood bedroom, my teenage bedroom. And uh, I'm just getting ready because uh, Tom, my boyfriend, and I are taking his mum out for afternoon tea. It's actually like a late... Well, we gave it... We said we would take her out when it was her birthday. Um, and now is a good time. And at the uh, afternoon tea place we like to go, it's called Ickworth House. Uh, if you live in Suffolk, it's lovely. It's my favourite afternoon tea place to go to. And um, they're doing like a winter afternoon tea and it's like frozen themed, which is excellent. Um, so everything's like blue. But yeah, I decided to have my hair straight today. I just thought I'd straighten it this morning just so it looks a bit different. But I'm just not used to it. Like, <laughs> what do you think? Do you like it? Do you not? It just looks so long. But um, yes, yeah, so I'll change it. I've just put my cape on. I don't know what, what like this clip is doing because it's not staying in place and it's also making my ear poke out which I hate <laughs> but yes I'll be going shortly but the pug meat was so cute <laughs> they always are lovely unfortunately the two that normally like organize it and know everyone um weren't very well oh no <laughs> weren't very well um so the sort of normal routine didn't happen and at first we were like, there's no one here. Like we bumped into a few pug people and we just sort of waited and hung around a bit. And we were like, oh, well, if it's only us, it's fine. We'll just go on a little walk. But then as you saw, lots more turned up, which was cute. So we love those. Rupert had his little run around, his little play. Oh, I need to cut my fringe so bad. Should have bought scissors with me to do a, do a DIY trim job, you know. These are my mom's straighteners. They're the GHD platinum ones. But uh, really looking forward to afternoon tea. I am hungry. Because afternoon tea is at one of those times it's like, mm. Because I had breakfast at like half eight. And now it's half one. And our afternoon tea is served at half two. So I'm hungry. <laughs> There's no point eating now because the afternoon tea is filling. As it should be, you know, you know. Righty. So hair, I've got my Dior earrings in, not that you can see that. Let's put these oh, away for mum. Do a bit of touchy touchy. I also took the red lipstick off just because it's not comfortable. <laughs> and also if I'm eating, I'd rather just have like a nude on that I can get rid of. But how are you all doing? I know this time of year is very difficult for a lot of people. I find it difficult um, because of the sort of festive expectation like am i doing enough am i doing too much do i look happy like it's difficult and also i'm really struggling um i've obviously got chronic conditions i've got fibromyalgia me i've also got epilepsy and it's just i haven't so far had a rest day in all of december um and normally i have like <laughs> an activity day or, or doing something sorry i was looking there not there or doing something and i have like a day or two in the middle so i'll finish uni stuff and um but i want to you know take advantage of december and all the festivities and all the activities that come along with it but i'm having to sort of relook at my plan oh no oh, there we go. i'm sort of having to relook at my plan and sort of sit, pick and choose a little bit which is quite disheartening but I know a lot of people are in the same boat if you've got a chronic condition, but it's just, it is frustrating because, you know, there's also certain expectation put on you as well. Like my friends are amazing and they do understand, but sometimes it's like, oh, it's fine. Like just, you know, we just stood up in a queue for another five minutes. I'm like, I physically can't do that. I need to go and sit down. Like my back was spasming yesterday. I was at Winter Wonderland. I was like, my back was spasming so much. And um, it was really quite painful. Where's my other camera? The only other thing about this clip is that it look like a bald patch there. I don't know where my actual big camera is. I need to put the lens cap on. Um, so I am struggling with that. But alas, I've got to keep going. But also, my cousin's just had her baby. And I am, of course, an auntie. So we're going to see that, uh, see her short one well, not today. In a couple of days, hopefully, we're going to get to see her because... Um, you know, let them have some time alone. But I'm so excited to have a baby. I love a baby, but yeah. <laughs> I'm having to sort of, you know, pick and choose a little bit, but it's okay. And I'm going, I'm actually going to Prague. <gasps> Very close to Christmas, going with my best friend Tash. So anyway, 
Let's get cracking, let's get cracking. <laughs> I think I like all of the sandwiches. Oh, lovely. How do they get it in? That is stunning. That's huge. Tom, stand next to it so you can see the difference. <laughs> oh, is it taller? Oh my god. That is lovely, isn't it? And hello, it is December 9th, which is a Monday. It is now 11 past five. I've just had a bath. I washed my hair as well. I also filmed a beauty minute, which is going up on Friday. So tomorrow when you see this video. And uh, yeah, it was a fun one. I used some like Christmassy skincare. So I had like a reindeer face mask, Brussels sprout lip balm, which I've gone on, you know. I used a Santa's belly lush bath thing, a little snowman bath fizzer. What else did I use? Like a lip scrub and Christmas pudding eye mask. It was just such fun. But anyway, so I have just been, what did I do? So I woke up at Tom's this morning. We had such a lovely afternoon tea yesterday with his mum. That was so nice. And then we just sort of all snuggled in their living room because they've got a lovely log fire and it was really nice. We watched the Strictly results. We watched Elizabeth's Missing, which was really good. Went to sleep. And then this morning I've been with my Rupert Bear and went on a lovely long walk and had a nap <laughs> i've just been getting things done i've been editing and sort of sorting everything for the week ahead i also had to sort out my medication at the doctors which was quite annoying um but yes i washed my hair i've got our little connect group tonight which is nice um so we're gonna have some food we're gonna hang out and it's, we'll just have a nice christmasy get together which would be nice um, but I have to pop to Asda because I want to pick up some like, because I think food wise tonight we're all bringing some, I'm get, I, I don't know, I th hope we're all bringing something, but I think we'll try and find like a festive platter or something. Um, but I also want to pick up my, obviously I bought my cousin's baby stuff for the baby shower, but now she's born and we know it's a girl. I'm like, what can I buy her? Um, and I know that Asda had some nice stuff. So I want to look, want to look and get her something because hopefully I'm seeing her tomorrow but yes this week we've hopefully got christmas shopping at blue water because girl i am behind normally i'm like done mid-november so i'm really stressed because there's there's like at the point of filming this i've my sister's done and that's it that's it so it's like oh gosh that's never i've never been this late um so yes hopefully that and then wednesday thursday friday we're going to a spa retreat which is really fun looking forward to having some chill i've just not been well i'm just not well i am my fibromyalgia is really like it's things are taking its toll um using my serum um it's it's difficult <laughs> but i'm trying to do like as many things that we have planned as possible but i am having to i did say this yesterday i think in a little segment i am having to sort of pick and choose which is annoying but i have to really think about my health um because at the medication sort of review today they were like you're you're very stressed i was like okay especially because of my eyes as well um she said because of my dermatitis it has been brought on by stress too um i think the stress because I'm not I don't think I'm stressed but obviously I'm stressed because I've got the physical effects of it but the stress is my worry of getting unwell I'm like oh gosh if I do this I'm gonna get ill should I still do it and it works it works me up so I'm not stressed because of like workload or uni or anything like that I think the stress is a result of me panicking and my anxiety of I don't want to like get really really ill again like I don't want my epic because I haven't had a you know a typical I have I've had like night seizures but I haven't had a, a typical epileptic seizure in a few years so that's all clear um, and it panics me I think if my fibro and ME and I overdo it that can obviously trigger a seizure so it's, it can be an endless circle so it's like oh the stress but anyway I'm gonna edit my beauty minute 
because I've got a little bit of time. I do just want to go like this. My back's really hurting today. Um, I'll do a bit of editing. When I was editing earlier, I was, I was like, Becca, you're so annoying. Like, my laugh is annoying. I say, um, a lot. And, and I go, and yeah. So yeah. <laughs> it's annoying. I'm just gonna apply my E45 on my eyelids and a bit of Vaseline on there. And I'll edit and I'll probably see you in Asda or something. Oh, and in today's advent calendar, today's advent calendar gift from my mum was... <gasps> pony, 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 pony. I love a Terry's chocolate orange. I know they sell them all year round, but like I save it for Christmas and then it's just magic. It's just glorious. So I'm going to eat that. Well, I'm not going to eat that. I am going to eat that, but not right now. <laughs> not all of it right now anyway. Maybe a segment, you know. Oh, it's like the men have... <laughs> oh. Are they? They're stormtroopers. I thought it was... They're stormtroopers. But it looks like Stranger Things. Yes, they've ruined it with stormtroopers. <laughs> Where are the female Christmas jumpers? Righty. Let's get some treats. Oh, look at that. Oh, it's like a long jumpery dress. Right, try and look at some of the little baby stuff. I'm kind of like, shall I get... Oh, but I don't know what size. She's new. She's literally just been born. A little Christmas outfit. Oh my gosh, so cute. I think that'd be way too big. Maybe one of these. Little Disney one. Oh. Oh. Some little. Oh my gosh. Why are baby clothes so adorable? Oh my gosh. Oh, that's so cute. <laughs> Want to get her something festive? they're all quite plain oh <gasps> should I get that that's fun crumpets I've already got some of those at home righty just need some bread but I like crusty bread maybe I'll get a French stick top one or bottom one that's Tom's that's mine that's Amy's do you want I think Joanna's is so neat apart from the evil eye